for this project i'm using the uh, dmc brand i bought this from lovecoche.com and this is 100 gram this is the coat color and i just use this like 60 gram not the whole bowl and the needle that i use is size 2.5 millimeters you will need markers and then scissors all right let's get started okay so first you need to make slip knot and then make uh, 24 chains all right I will meet you guys when you have 24 chains when you have 24 chains you're gonna skip three stitches so one two three and double crochet into the fourth stitch double crochet in there so this is the first double crochet here we don't count the chain okay so then in this row we're gonna make double crochet into each stitch this is second double crochet and third double crochet fourth double crochets so make, keep making the double crochet into each stitch till you come to the last stitch on the end I will meet you guys there when you have one stitch left from the end we're gonna make five double crochets in there into the same stitch so this is one two three okay you're gonna paste and marker when you have the third stitch third double crochet i mean okay now we have three and then four and five into the same stitch okay five double crochet into the same stitch All right, for this side, we're gonna make double crochets into each stitch. This is gonna be the next stitch. Double crochet in there. Okay, so you just keep making double crochets into each stitch till you come to the end and I will meet you guys there. When you come to the end, you will have total of 45 double crochets. But the first chain, remember, I tell you guys we don't count right here. We don't count this chain, alright? For row 2, you're gonna chain 3. Turn it over and double crochets into very first stitch oops and we don't count the first three chain okay and then it's just making double crochets into each stitch all right keep making that till you come to the marker and i will meet you guys there when you come to the stitch before the marker and now you're gonna take the marker out and then make five double crochets in that stitch into the same stitch so one and two three when you have the third double crochet you're gonna paste the marker and then four and five all right now we have five double crochets into the same stitch 
and then now we're just gonna make double crochets into each stitch all right keep making that till you come to the end and I will meet you guys there when you come to the end you will have 49 double crochet and for row 3 you're gonna chain 3 turn it over and double crochet into very first stitch right here So the first three chain we don't count and just making double crochet into each stitch till you come to the stitch before the marker and I will meet you guys there. When you come to the stitch before the marker and then you're gonna take the marker out and make five double crochets into the same stitch so one two three and put the marker into the third double crochet and four and five okay five double crochets into the same stitch and then make double crochets into each stitch all right keep making that till you come to the end of the rows and i will meet you guys there when you come to the end you will have total of 53 double crochets and for row four you're gonna do the same chain three turn it over and double crochets into each stitch so don't forget the very first stitch okay for three chain we don't count okay so you just keep making that till you come to the stitch before the marker I will meet you guys there when you come to the stitch before the marker and now you're gonna take the marker out and make five double crochets into that stitch one two and three and put the marker into the third double crochet and four and five okay and make double crochets into each stitch all right so keep repeating that Till you come to the end of the rows and I will meet you guys there when you come to the end you will have total of 57 double crochet and for row 5 we're gonna do the same chain 3 turn it over and double crochets into each stitch so don't forget the very first stitch and for 3 chain always we don't count okay so you just keep repeating this and when you come to the marker you're gonna make five double crochets into the same stitch and put the marker into the third double crochet till you have total of eight rows and when you come to the end of the rows five you will have 61 double crochet and then the end of row 6 you will have 65 double crochets and the end of row 7 you will have 69 double crochets and the end of row 8 you will have 73 double crochets okay so I will meet you guys when you have total of 8 rows when you have total of 8 rows you will have 73 double crochets and now you're gonna chain one turn it over and skip three stitches so count really first stitch two so one two and three and eight double crochets into the fourth stitch
and skip two stitches so one and two and then single crochets into the third stitch and now skip two stitches one two eight double crochets into the third stitch And skip two stitches. So one, two, single crochet into the third stitch. And skip two stitches. And eight double crochet into the third stitch. skip two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch all right so keep repeating this till you come to the top the marker and I will meet you guys there when you come to the top it will look like this and we're gonna do the same skip two stitches so one two and then single crochets into the third stitch which is the marker stitch single crochet in there do the same skip two stitches one two and eight double crochet into the third stitch and skip two stitches so one two single crochet into the third stitch all right so just keep repeating this do the same pattern till you come to the end of the rows and i will meet you guys there when you come to the end you will have total of 12 stitches of this stitch so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay we, now we're gonna make slip stitch so skip two stitches and make slip stitch into the third stitch so insert the needle in there pull up the loop and pull through and chain one to lock the yarn and then you just cut the yarn and now we are done making the first cup for the second cup you are gonna do exact same thing okay do this stitch till you have two stitch left all right and I will meet you guys there when you have the second cup and you will have two stitch left okay and now you are gonna skip two stitches so one, two, and make four double crochets into the third stitch. One, two, three, and four. And you're gonna bring the first cup that you had made. So this is the right side. This is the wrong side. Put the right side up like so and now we're gonna connect the first cup into the second cup okay so you're gonna insert the needle around here right here insert the needle in there pull up the loop and pull it through and four more double crochets into the same space so 
one, two, and three, and four. Okay, you will have to total up eight double crochet in same stitch. So skip two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch. And skip two stitches, one, two, and four double crochets into the third stitch. One, two, three, and four. And we're gonna connect into this cup. So insert the needle around here. Insert the needle in there. If you're not sure, you count as well into the fourth double crochet. Okay, so the needle pull up the loop and pull through, and four more double crochets into the same space. One, two three and four okay you will have total of eight double crochet in same stitch so now you're gonna slip stitch into really in stitch pull up the loop and pull through chain one to lock the yarn all right now we have two cup connected and next I'm gonna show you guys how to make uh, the stitch around under the cup all right okay so first you need to bring the yarn and make slip knot and make 33 chains so one two three four five all right keep making the chains and I'll meet you guys when you have 33 chains when you have 33 chains, you're gonna bring uh, the bikini top, put the right side up, and then make three single crochets into this gap right here. Three single crochets. So one, two, three, and three single crochets into the next gap. One, two, three, three single crochets into next gap. Three single crochets into the next gap. Three single crochets into the next gap. three single crochets into the next gap three single crochets into the next gap so in each gap you will make three single crochets in there all right i will meet you guys when you come in the middle here when you come to the middle we're gonna make six chains so one, two, three, four, five, and six, and three double crochets into this gap. And three double crochets into the next gap. three double crochets into the next gap so in each gap we just put uh, make three double crochet in there so yeah keep repeating that till you come to the end of the rows and I will meet you guys there when you come to the end and now we're gonna make 33 chains so one two three four five all right, keep making the chain and I will meet you guys when you have 33 chains. When you have 33 chains, we're gonna make one more chain. 
and turn it over and skip the very first stitch skip this stitch and single crochet into the second stitch and now make single crochet into each stitch all right keep making single crochet into each stitch till you come to the end and i will meet you guys there when you come to the end you will have total of 168 stitches okay and now turn it over so skip three stitches so one two three and four double crochets into the fourth stitch. One, two, three, and four. And chain one. Four more double crochets into the same stitch. One, two, three and four skip three stitches one two three and single crochets into the fourth stitch one single crochet okay and skip three stitches one two three and four double crochets into the fourth stitch one two three four and chain one four more double crochets into the same stitch and skip three stitches one two three single crochet into the fourth stitch skip three stitches one two three four double crochets into the fourth stitch chain one four more double crochets into the same stitch Skip three stitches, one, two, three, single crochet into the fourth stitch. Alright, so keep repeating this same pattern till you come to the end of the rows, and I will meet you guys there. When you come to the end, you're gonna do the same skip three stitches and then uh, single crochets into the fourth stitch which is the last stitch for this row single crochet in there chain three turn it over and double crochets into very first stitch right here chain two single crochet right here right on top of this stitch chain 2 and double crochet right here and chain 1 and double crochet into the same stitch chain 2 single crochet right here chain 2 double crochet right here and chain one double crochet into the same stitch here chain two single crochet right here and chain two double crochet right here chain one 
double crochets into the same stitch right here chain two and single crochet right here chain two double crochet right here chain one and double crochet into the same stitch chain two single crochet right here all right so you just keep repeating this till you come to the end of the rows and i will meet you guys there okay so when you come to the end after you single crochet on top of this stitch we're gonna make two chain and then two double crochet into really last stitch right here one and two two double crochet in there and chain three turn it over and make four double crochets into this gap in between uh, two single crochet uh, I mean two double crochet here okay four double crochet in there so one two three and four and single crochet right here and four double crochets in this gap one two three four and chain one four more double crochets into the same space one two three and four single crochet right here four double crochets into next gap right here chain one four more double crochets into the same space single crochet right here okay and four double crochets into the next gap right here chain one four more double crochets into the same space single crochet right here oops all right so you just keep repeating this so yeah the same pattern all right i will meet you guys when you come to the end of the rows when you come to the end we're gonna make four double crochets into this gap in between two double crochet yeah so four double crochet in there one two three four oops and then make one double crochet into the stitch this stitch not in the gap okay one double crochet and then turn it over and chain two and double crochet right here chain one and double crochets into same space chain two single crochet right here 
chain 2 and double crochet right here chain 1 and double crochets into the same space chain 2 single crochet right here and chain 2 double crochet right here chain 1 double crochet into the same space chain 2 and single crochet right here chain 2 double crochet right here chain 1 and double crochet into the same space chain 2 single crochet right here alright so you just keep repeating this till you come to the end of the rows and I will meet you guys right here when you come to the end you're gonna chain 2 and then uh, single crochet into the last stitch right here single crochet and turn it over and four double crochets into this gap this gap And chain one four more double crochets into the same space one two three and four and single crochet right here four double crochet into this gap And chain one, four more double crochet into the same space. And single crochet right here. Four double crochet into next gap. Chain one, four more double crochet into the same space. Oops. And single crochet right here. All right, so keep repeating this till you come to the end of the rows and I will meet you guys there when you come to the end we are gonna make single crochet into the last stitch right here and chain 3 turn it over and double crochet into really first stitch right here chain 2 single crochet right here chain 2 double crochet right here chain 1 and double crochet into the same space chain 2 single crochet right here chain 2 double crochet right here chain 1 and double crochet into the same space chain 2 single crochet right here all right so you just keep repeating this and I will meet you guys when you come to the end of the rows when you come to the end and chain 2 and then make 
two double crochet into the last stitch one and two okay and chain three turn it over and then make four double crochet into this gap in between two double crochet four double crochet in there one two three and four and single crochet right here and then make eight double crochets into next gap one two three four five six seven and eight all right and then single crochet right here and then eight double crochets into the next gap one two three four five six seven and eight and single crochet right here eight double crochet into the next gap And single crochet right here all right so you just keep repeating this till you come to the end of the rows and I will meet you guys there when you come to the end you're gonna make four double crochet into this gap right here one two three and four and then one double crochet into the stitch not in the gap into this stitch and turn this side and chain three and then two double crochet into this stitch one two and two double crochet into the next gap one double crochet into next stitch okay and one double crochet into next stitch and two double crochet into the next gap two double crochet into the next gap one double crochet into next stitch one double crochet into the last stitch right here okay okay so this is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve we have 12 double crochet okay for this row for the first three chain we don't count okay and chain three turn it over and skip the very really first stitch here yeah? and double crochet into next stitch So you just keep making the double crochet into each stitch.
this last stitch right here okay and chain three turn it over and then skip the very first stitch skip this one and double crochet into the next one and just making double crochet into each stitch This is going to be the last stitch and chain 3, turn it over, skip the very first stitch and double crochet into next stitch and then just double crochet into each stitch. This the last stitch here. Chain three, turn it over, and skip the really first stitch, double crochet into next stitch. Double crochet into last stitch right here, chain three. Oops, turn it over and skip the very first stitch. Double crochet into next stitch and just double crochet into each stitch. This is last stitch here. Chain three. Turn it over and skip the really first stitch. Double crochet into next stitch. This is last stitch here. Chain three, turn it over and skip the really first stitch, double crochet into next stitch, and double crochet into each stitch. Last stitch, and chain three, turn it over and skip the really first stitch and double crochet into next stitch and chain three turn it over and skip the really first stitch double crochet into next stitch And double crochet into each stitch okay now we have three double crochet and then include three chain we will have four double crochet and now we chain three and turn it over all right from now on we're gonna make double crochet into really first stitch too all right Chain three, turn it over, and then double crochet into each stitch, includes the really first stitch too. Okay, so keep repeating this till you have about 16 inches. 
I gonna make about 16 inches but if you want to make a longer in that no problem go ahead and then yeah I will meet you guys there okay so when I have about 16 inches it don't look like this you can have as long as you like so I start from here to here is 16 inches and I'm gonna show you guys how to make the last stitch so chain 3 turn it over and skip the really first stitch okay yarn over insert the needle into this stitch pull up the loop and pull out two loops all right and yarn over insert the needle into next stitch pull up the loop pull out two loops and now we're gonna pull it all out like so and chain one to lock the yarn and then you just cut the yarn and put the yarn out alright so we have one side done and you are gonna make exact same with the other side as well alright and I will meet you guys when you are done making that side okay so when you have two side done see this side done and this side done and now we're gonna make the strap okay and first so you're gonna make the uh, insert the needle into the third double crochet here right here around here okay and then pull the yarn out and tie a knot insert the needle into the same stitch pull up the loop and chain 3 and then double crochet into each stitch okay this is gonna be the last stitch okay for this row you will have total of six double crochet so one two three four five and six for the first three chain we don't count okay turn it over and chain three skip the very first stitch double crochet into next stitch We don't count the first three chain okay so when you come the end of this row you will have five double crochets turn it over chain three and skip the really first stitch and double crochet into next stitch last stitch here you will have four double crochet the first three chain we don't count turn it over chain three skip the really first stitch and double crochet into next stitch last stitch here turn it over and chain 3 so from now on we're gonna make double crochet into really first stitch 2 okay double crochet in really first stitch and then double crochet into each stitch okay you will have three double crochet so if you Includes the first three chain, it'll be four double crochet. So don't forget to make double crochet into really first stitch. Chain 
crochet three double crochet into very first stitch and double crochet into each stitch all right so you just keep repeating this i gonna make about 19 inches so you can make as long as you like all right and i will meet you guys there okay so when you have about 19 inches or as long as you like okay so start from here see 19 inches and I'm gonna show you guys how to make the last stitch and cut the yarn so chain 3 and skip the very first stitch okay and then yarn over insert the needle into the second stitch pull up the loop pull out two loops and yarn over insert the needle into the next stitch which is the last stitch pull up the loop pull out two loops and now we're gonna pull it all out and chain one to lock the yarn and then cut the yarn Put the yarn out. Okay, so you're gonna make the same exact same with this side. Alright, so and I will meet you guys when you have this side done. Okay, when you have the straps both sides done. So both gonna be the same side, okay? So you're just gonna like tie like a bow or some. So all the tail, you're just gonna hide it and then cut it the same here. Try to hide the tail and cut it. So yeah, congratulations. You just done making the beautiful bikini top. So thank you so much for watching. Bye.